Hi guys and welcome to my channel. In this video I am going to show you how I go from super super frizzy and damaged looking hair to this silky smooth hair that I have right now. Something that you guys do not really know about my hair because mostly when you see my hair I have styled it obviously but my hair has gotten quite damaged uh, recently actually. I dyed uh, no, I bleached my hair like six months ago, I would say, and after that bleach, it was a bleach that I'd never tried before, my hair was very, very damaged. And as you guys can see right, right here, I have some parts that are so damaged that I had to cut them off. And some parts actually just fell off. They were so fried that they just fell off. Um, I have some right in my neck and also, uh, let's see if I can find them. It's not very nice when you can see a part like this on the top of your head, you know? It looks like I have extensions, which I don't, um, so I have to hide them pretty much every single day. It is very damaged but I hide it in a very good way <laughs> I guess because a lot of you comment that I have such like fresh and non-damaged hair which is not really true but sure it could be worse. But yeah this video is also a collaboration with Sebastian Professionals. Here are some of the products from them. I absolutely love them. Sebastian Professionals are a very professional brand. <laughs> Obviously they're made by professionals and they are just so so good. You can really feel that they are high quality. So I will show you how I use them and I will use the three products that I use pretty much every single day when I do just this like straight hairstyle. Um, so yeah, if you want to see that, then just keep on watching. So as you guys can see, my hair does not look very straight and silky when I've just gotten out of the shower. I've just taken a shower and blow dried my hair. Um, and as you guys can see, you can really like notice that I've bleached it a lot and that I backcombed it throughout many, many years. I start off by combing my hair. And I always start at the ends, just to like, again, not damage it as much. So I always start by the ends and then work my way up. So this is one side just combed and it does look a lot better. But when you touch it, it feels very, very frizzy. Um, and just in need of some type of styling. It does not look good yet. So yeah, I will comb the other side. <laughs> I just noticed that I look like just a floating head when I have a black background and a black t-shirt on. Maybe I should change. <laughs> One second. <laughs> My biggest secret to healthy looking hair is a hair oil. And if you don't have one, you need to get a hair oil ASAP. They have loads of different like types of oil from different brands. The one that I'm going to use today is from Sebastian Professionals and it's their dark oil. And I love this one as it is very thick. And even though I have Scandinavian hair, it's just perfect for me and my very bleached hair. So I'm just going to take like three pumps like that and massage it into my hair. And I honestly, I don't know if this is only my hair, but I go way up, like, to these parts that are fried. <laughs> I don't, like, massage my roots or anything, but I do take the oil throughout my entire hair. And it works for me, so you just have to, like, try it and see if it uh, works for you and your hair. And as you guys can see, as soon as I use the oil, it looks way healthier and just shiny. And yes, I do use like three pumps on each side. I know it sounds a lot, but I don't know, it works for me. And now for styling, I choose if I want a middle parting or if I want a side parting. 
But for today, I think I'm going with the middle. And then I part my hair in four parts. So the bottom hair, and then I put the other hair like back so I don't use it. So I start off by this part. So I have one, two, three, four. Yeah, you get it. <laughs> and then I take a straightening iron and I use my tangle teaser to brush it while I comb it. Like that. And when I come to the end, I just go in a C shape. <laughs> I don't know, I just curl the ends just a tiny, tiny bit. This will make it look so much healthier. And for these thin parts that are very damaged, I just go through them quite quickly and just make them straight. I take my tangle taser and then my straightening iron and then I make it flat. So again, at the end, I just curl it slightly. And for these damaged parts, I just go through very quickly and curl the ends there as well. So we just, um, so you can't see it as much because it does not look very nice. <laughs> So this is one side straight in and as you guys can see it just looks so much healthier and it feels so much healthier and it's just the best and it takes me like one minute honestly. So I will do the other side and then we will style it a bit. So like this now my hair is fully straight in and as you guys can see it looks very very like fresh and silky and it feels amazing but you guys know I love to have a bit of volume so of course I'm going to fix that and for that my favorite thing to do is to use some sort of salt spray or texture spray and this one is from Sebastian Professionals as everything um, the texture maker so this is a spray you can use it damp hair you can use it as wet hair but I usually I don't know why I shake it I don't know maybe you shouldn't but I always do and I like to remove the top layer of my hair remove it <laughs> I'm just going to lay it over and then I take the texture maker and just spray my roots When I've like massaged it into my roots, I like to go in and tease it just a tiny bit. I don't know why, I just, I can't go like a day without teasing my hair. It's, it's a curse. <laughs> but I like to use my tangle teaser, which I think is a bit more um, kinder to my hair. So I just go in and do just a bit of teasing like that. As you guys can see, I do not tease it a lot, like I only go in with like one, two, maybe three, like that. And then of course, don't forget the back, so I'm going to do the same here. I'm going to use the texture maker and I'm going to tease it just a ton, a ton of it. <laughs> And when I'm teasing, and when I'm teasing the back, I have to be quite careful as <laughs> these parts are here. So I have to keep that in mind and make sure it's teased with the longer hair. Um, I hope you guys can see this. This is the uh, damaged part that does not look very nice. It looks like I have extensions and this is my real hair. But it's not, it's just very damaged. Um, so I'm going to go in again and I'm going to pick out some of the parts that I can find. 
And I'm just going to brush them and use the straightening iron again and just curl them so very slightly so you can't see them as much. <laughs> So like that, and now for the final part, I will use some hairspray just to make these damaged part uh, lay down, and also just to keep the style for forever. I was going to say, but for the entire day, of course. I'm going to use the reshaper hairspray. Why do I shake things? Should I? I always shake my hair products. No, you shouldn't. <laughs> Why am I doing that? Okay, so I just spray like the entire hair pretty much down to here. I start here. So I like shape my hair while I spray it. Make them stick down to the longer hair. So yeah, this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope you guys got some tips and tricks if you also have very damaged hair or if it's just very frizzy or I don't know, if you just wanted to see how I do it. And this is what I do. I do not do this every day. I do it whilst I have washed my hair and then I do not have to do it until I wash it again. So all of these products that I've been using in this video is honestly like favorites of mine. Um, the dark oil is amazing. I don't know if you can see it. There you go. It's so black. Um, it's amazing. I love how thick it is. And it just goes so well with my damaged hair. And then the texture maker and also the hairspray. Amazing texture maker. I always use also if I'm going to curl it or if I'm going to do these waves uh, that I love to do. I will link it here so you can see it. Or here, who knows. <laughs> so for all of these products that I've used today, I will link them down below, of course. And I really have to say that I absolutely love them. They are amazing. You can really feel that they are made by professionals and for professionals. And even though you and I, well, I don't know about you, but I'm not a professional, but you can use them either way, you know, obviously. So yeah, I will hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see each other in my next video. Bye guys.